Hey guys, Morin here. Now this is one movie I have to make. Now, when I came here to Austin to my apartment, I had this chair here, and you know, it it's okay for like one hour study sessions, but it's not really good for like gaming 12 hours or sitting in front of the computer for a very long time. So, um, what pretty much happened was, let's throw it away. What pretty much happened was, um, luckily a few weeks after I came here, a company actually contacted me and was asking me, hey, can we give you a chair, I'll provide you with a chair, and you make a review of it. And I was like, okay, sure, let's do this, but what you don't know is that the company is actually a Chinese company. Like it's a Chinese company that actually asked me to help them get into the market, make a nice review, and I was like, okay, I kind of need a chair, so why not? Apparently, like I'm, a, I'm one of the biggest... Um, chair reviewers in the business apparently like um, I did a DX Racer chair review and that completely blew the chair off so companies that like, keep contacting me and keep sending me the chairs but uh, yeah um, as far as it goes um, contact with Chinese company was actually like good and I was pretty surprised that not every like Chinese guy is a gold farmer like that really like was a big wow effect for me that they actually like also produce other stuff but in any case um, let's get started now um, the chair is pretty comfortable, you know, I've never had any problems sitting on it, whereas on the chair of hell, um, I had problems sitting on it, because, you know, once you get used to better chairs like DX Race and others, it's really hard to, like, get back to, like, as I call it, really bad chairs. Now, the chair, um, different functions that it has is, um, of course, you can turn it around and stuff, but one function is you can sleep on it, um, which is also why it's called napping chair, but just as an example, uh, whenever I feel like it, I can just fall asleep. And it's actually pretty comfortable, like almost like a bed. Um, now another feature this chair has is um, here, um, it actually has something for the legs as well. You can just roll this out, as you can see here, it's below the chair usually, then do it in this position. And this makes your sleeping position even more comfortable. So I could just, if I wanted to, I could just go to sleep right now. And yeah, it's pretty cool to like be able to game take a one or two hour power nap and be able to play games again and yeah I'm really happy that I got this chair I don't know what I should do like I'm leaving in two or three days and it's kind of like sad that I have to leave it here I can't take it with me to Europe um, but yeah I just want to thank the company um, I hope my review helps them because I think it's a good product um, now you need to make your own opinion of course what you want to have the only thing I can tell you is um, don't just use a crap chair because even though if you're young, for example, let's say you're between 15 and 25, if you're young, you won't realize anything, but if you always sit on like a bad chair in a bad position, you could have problems later on. And I like for a period of time I had, I was sitting on a crap chair and then actually like um, didn't feel too well in the back for like a few weeks until I switched to better, better chairs. And since then I've never had problems anymore. So that was it for today. Um, Maybe like if I keep getting so popular as chair reviewer, I should just like switch my business from reviewing games and playing games, making guides to just reviewing chair. So apparently that seems to work out. So yeah, hope you guys are not too confused. Thanks for watching. I'll be back.